October 1978, Stadnik decided to seize the opportunity and forge his way into the major leagues. He rode to Montreal and met Yves Bateau, the national president of the Hells Angels at the time. Stadnik wanted to patch over and join his side. Bateau agreed. Just as they were finishing up the meeting, two outlaws crashed into the bar and a shootout started. They called it the Le Turbillon Massacre. The dust settled after the two assassins fell dead, taking one Hells Angel with them. Bateau survived the assassination attempt and so did Walter Stadnik. The next few months, many wild ones lost their lives at the hands of the outlaws MC. Parente and his Hamilton chapter swore to finish Stadnik and his crew. 